As a fisherman, every lake we encounter helps shape us into who we are. Each lake leaves an impact, whether it's good or bad. This lake, however, is more than that. This lake is my home lake. This is a lake where I grew up. This is a lake where I fished my very first tournament. This is the first lake I ever won any money in. It holds a very special place in my heart. This lake is Rim Lake. Some love it, some hate it. To me, it's home. So how's it going everybody? I'm in the truck this morning on my way to the third stop of the Illini Division. My home lake, Ren Lake. Well, this one means a lot. It's not often I get to sleep in my own bed the night before a tournament. And, you know, only drive five minutes to the ramp, so that's going to be a really nice luxury. But i got to catch them today. I'm sitting 40th in points. I've got to find a way to catch them. It's going to be tough. Figured out a couple things in practice that... I don't know if it's going to work or not, but I got him to bite a spinnerbait and a crankbait. No real big ones. I did catch one keeper the two evenings I practiced, so that's not real good, but it's at least better than nothing. So it's at least a little something to go on. But I think my biggest challenge will be when to change over to fishing more of a slower bait like a Texas rig or a shaky head or something since I got bit on the moving baits. If I'm not getting bit on the moving baits, it's going to be hard to put them down. So that's going to be my biggest challenge of when to switch over. But I don't know, because every area on Wren can be different. You might not get bit on one thing here and then go up a mile up the lake and end up getting 10 bites on it. So it's just, you never know. It's just, it's a hard lake. It's going to be tough today, I think. Uh, I don't think it's going to take much weight on either side to possibly do really good. So, But that's, uh, that's pretty much it for right now. Um, I mean, this this one means a lot. So, if I could get a trophy that says Ren Lake on it, it would it'd mean the world to me. It'd be amazing. Fished my very first ever bass tournament on this lake. I grew up fishing from the bank over here as a kid, so it's just, it's got a lot of memories. Camping over here with grandparents, and mom and dad, and then, you know, now me and my wife and everybody. It's just, it's, it's special. So, it'd be really cool to, really cool to do well over here, so. See you guys at the lake, and uh, hopefully the next time you see me, he's catching some fish, so stay tuned. We come to you once again, and we are grateful and thankful for everything you've given us. We are thankful for this body of water, and these fishermen to go out and pursue the sport that they love. Father, I ask you to watch over each and every one of them today, and they're safely. Return them back safely, not only to weigh in, but to their travels, their family, and their friends. Also, you ask you to watch, also ask you to lay your hand upon them and let them fish to their fullest potential. Father, we also ask you to watch over our men and women fighting for our freedoms here in our country borders and abroad and letting us live in this wonderful country that we do. We ask this in your loving name. Amen. If everyone can please stand the flag right there in the flag boat. So is this area where you got all them big bites at? Or? There's a good one. Coming up. Ready? I'll be right in there. Two. Oh. No, I didn't even fish over here. I just looked at it and I'm like, it looks right. So. Get these call tags out of here. 
your side real quick. Yep. Yeah, it, earlier it looked like the north end, but now it's yeah. kind of like, it's taking a weird motion. Here it comes. Here it comes. There you go. Ah, yeah. He was on there for a second. Wasn't very big, but. Having that trailer hook on there, I'm surprised he didn't get one in his face. Oh, did you see that? Something blew up on it as soon as it hit the water. I mean, just as soon as it hit the water. Good. Hang on, baby. There you go. Son of a bitch. Happened so quick, I can't even get to the net. <laughs> you what? Just think the state of Illinois. That feels good to get that monkey off my back, dude. Holy crap. You have no idea how good that feels. I haven't caught a keeper bass in four tournaments. There's another one. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> 